Now, when you're just starting out in your marriage, there are a lot of things for a new couple to figure out, not the least of which is how to divide the holidays between two families. Our resident relationship expert has some advice on how to navigate the holidays. Hi, I'm Dana McNeil, and I'm the I Do Resident Relationship Expert. I'm here to help you be the best couple that you can be, to give you tips and tricks on how to be a master of relationship versus a disaster of relationship. So let's talk about healthy boundaries around the holidays as a couple. One of the things that couples come to me often about is what do we do now that we're getting married? I can't shuffle off to my parents' house and you can't go to yours, or can you? And is it okay that we don't if we decide not to? So here's the deal. You guys are now your own family. We're not our family of origin anymore. We're the family that we're creating. And what's our legacy gonna be as a couple moving forward? Is it that we don't open presents on Christmas morning? I know, shocking. Is that do we wait until the evening after we've had a big meal? Do we not want to see our parents on Christmas morning? And is it okay that we let them feel frustrated or disappointed, right? We are not doing it because we don't love them. We are creating our own family moving forward. And at some point, if we add to our family, we wanna have our own traditions in place that we can share with them. So if that means that you choose to give yourself permission to do something different than you've been doing in your relationships with your family before you got married, that's okay. Great advice there. If you have a question for Dana, follow us on Instagram, post your question there, and who knows, maybe your question will end up on a future show.